who, not how. That is the key lesson we've learned this past year in order to grow and scale our business successfully. Is that we cannot be the ones doing every single thing in our business. We have to find people who are good at or better, preferably better at the stuff that we aren't good at or stuff that takes away our energy that we don't like doing that want to do it for us. Take markets, for example. We hate doing markets. <laughs> they take a lot of time, usually on the weekends. Our setup is not very good looking. <laughs> and so we decided to not do markets anymore. However, today we did our, our first Christmas market of the year. It's currently 5.15 on a Saturday. I'm at the warehouse by myself. And we did a market today. And this was the first market that I wasn't there, that I did not do. Never in the history of local laundry ever has there been a market that I wasn't a part of, except for today. And that was really exciting. We found someone to do markets for us, everything. Apply for the market, take all of our stuff over, set up, sell, do the hiring for the market, take down, bring all the stuff back. All I had to do today was yesterday, I had to have everything ready for pickup. And today I had to be at the warehouse to help unload. And that was it. And they sold at the market for us. We did pretty well for, for a market that I wasn't there at. And it's just, it just blows my mind that we did a market and I wasn't there. Neither was my business partner. And so it just came, unloaded everything Monday morning. We're gonna put everything together um, back in its place. Don't worry, Brian, we're gonna have your warehouse looking really good, I promise you. But it's just, who not how? Who not how? <laughs> I'm marveled by this idea. So if you're a small business owner, there's a great book by Dan Martell called Who Not How, and it's all about finding people to do the things that you can't do. That's the only way you're gonna grow your business. So we just did a market, and I wasn't there, and now we're gonna do more markets. We have another market two weeks time, and you better believe I'm not gonna be there. <laughs> and I'm really looking forward to it. So what else in our business can we look for that is taking up our, most of our time that we don't enjoy doing, that we can actually get someone in to do a better job for us. And I have to say the market setup, like you can see the photos. If you were at the market, the, the setup was 10 times better than anything we could have done, you know? And so who not how, what else in our business can we find that we don't have to do that? We can find someone else to do so that we can focus on the stuff that we're actually good at. Pumped, pumped on a Saturday night. <laughs> I hope you have a great Saturday night.